Uh, but the, the biggest now is opportunities in, in terms of job opportunities. But you, you find now the government have affirmative actions. They, they'll tell you, no, no, no. For every, mm -hmm. this position is only reserved for, 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 for women. Uh, there's another challenge is mentorship. Welcome. This is another Saturday. And uh, we are glad it's a great pleasure to always have you around, to always have you, you know, uh, catching up with us every Saturday. It's 6 p.m. And I won't tell you this is dialogue at the well, where we give you information, where we equip you so that we can be able to impact a generation. We can be able to meet, to have, uh, you know, a young people. We can, have to, we can, we can be able to have uh, people that are ready to change in their times and their seasons. And uh, today we have a great man. We have a boy child. Today we have a boy child. The other day we had a girl child. Today we have a boy child that is going to, you know, uh, to give us details about uh, a boy child. So this is another, you get ready for uh, another <coughs> great show. And I want to tell you, it's going to be amazing. We are ready for a great and an amazing, very amazing conversation. I want to uh, give uh, my guest a chance to introduce himself as we get rolling. Welcome, sir. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Prince. Uh, yes. I'm, uh, I'm Elias Kiplanga Trotich. I'm a professional engineer. And... Uh, 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 what do you call it? A community leader uh -huh. and uh, a boy child uh, activist. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. And and again, I want to thank you for this uh, for the invite. Mm. I know it was uh, it was a short notice, but uh, <laughs> I'm here now. So and uh, boy child, we need to discuss. I mean, yeah, the, the most important uh, uh, aspect. Wow. Thanks, thanks. Welcome, welcome, sir. Uh, keep. Uh, Kip is a friend and is a, is a, is a, is a great man, he's is an engineer as he said and he's been quite involved in matters of um, what happens around as you learn that he's also a community leader. So that tells you this is somebody that is interacting with uh, different people at different times and uh, also experiencing and realizing some of the challenges that they are going through. So. Uh, this is another Saturday that you cannot afford to miss. Where, Nimesema, the other day we were on the girl child. So today we are out there on the plight of the boy child. And uh, as we get into our topic, uh, keep, eh, we want to uh, get to know that uh, what usually what has happened and uh, in our community, in our society, in our families, in our country, uh, especially in our country, Kenya, um, kijana <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think it is a, it's, it's a yes and a no kind of. <laughs> <laughs> it's a yes and a no. Okay. Uh, because uh, I, I, I'm, I'm for the feeling that um, our society, our and rather our, our community is so much focused on the girl child. I usually remember a scenario when I was a small boy. Actually, we have a girl from our home. Eh? When I was a small boy, I remember. Every time, Johnny to Kifika, our mother used to ask, Musiana uh, mumemwacha wapi? Like me, I have never had a single day my mother asking our sister, Eya me tuwacha wapi? It was. So, is there a possibility that uh, the way uh, the boy child has been brought up is, is that uh, the boy child is neglected? Not really. I, I mean, uh, the way, the, I mean in, in, uh, the way I see it, uh, uh -huh. And the way I told you is that uh, it's a yes or no uh -huh. uh, scenario. Uh -huh. One, the yes in the sense that uh, you, you know, you know, you know how we grew up. Yes. And uh, and now mm -hmm. are totally two two different two uh, different things. Two, two, yeah. two, two, two different things. The uh -huh. way the way probably you were raised or the way I was raised yeah. and uh, the way now we are raising our kids and mm -hmm. and, and, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm has totally changed. The things have changed. So when you look at um, at before, uh -huh. at before now, probably, I was born in the 80s, in the mm. 80s myself, so, so I've experienced both lives. Seek it up, Seek it up. <laughs> <laughs> so I've already experienced uh -huh. the two aspects of, uh, you know now, the, 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 the old, the, you know, the old. We were in the transition. Eh? Uh, Our yeah. age was in the transition <laughs> now of the old, the, inter exactly. the, 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 the internet age, and uh -huh. uh, the, the old age mm. and the internet age. Uh -huh. So when you look at it from, where we, we come from, yeah. the, um, the culture itself, mm -hmm. the culture itself yeah. uh, was different from, is different from Very now. Very different from what is happening yes. today. Yeah. And that one, the way I'm, I see, mm -hmm. is what actually shaped 
the 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 the, the operands. Uh -huh. And also that one has a direct impact uh -huh. on yes. on now the, the way the boy child is. Mm -hmm. In my in my yes situation is uh -huh. is this. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because of now the um, activism, activism yeah. in eighties, nineties. Yeah. Uh, and uh, the, our culture at times those days were a bit uh, when you look at it, it was somewhat retrogressive to the to the to the girl child. But uh -huh. now this is from um this is from an outsider uh -huh. point of view. Uh -huh. But when you look at the culture itself, the uh, culture, uh, it's okay. I mean, the, the culture was okay yeah. with, with, the, with the place of the, of the woman mm -hmm. and the place of the child at that time. Because mm -hmm. uh, most, most cultures in Kenya is, is patriarchal. Yeah, yeah. Is the man who calls the shorts and, and, mm -hmm. and everything. Yeah. So the boy is raised. But was 90% of them. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it was raised on the aspect that uh -huh. this boy... Mm -hmm. From the outside, they look like uh, they were neglected at that yeah. time, but they were being shaped to yeah. be who they are. Mm -hmm. Now, now the, the, the activism of 80s, 70s, 80s now br brought a lot of uh, changes, mm -hmm. which, uh, which uh, a lot of changes to, to the way uh, we were seeing culture. Mm -hmm. Now, the, the, the empowerment, women empowerment, and, and that kind of, of situation. Because mm -hmm. those days, uh, probably the girl child was not even taken to school because they were being raised to be wives and, mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Yeah. So the, the, the emphasis now grew mm -hmm. to empowering the girl child. Uh -huh. And then now, mm -hmm. we did not again, it reaches a point now, we did not empower mm -hmm. the boy child equally. So we are yeah. getting now a situation yeah. now that uh, mm -hmm. the girl child is more educated, mm -hmm. more conscious of, 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 of themselves, mm -hmm. but the boy is still... Uh, <laughs> is still there. Now, yes. Still on that, yes. on uh, the point that you are putting across, eh? Is there a possibility, because, okay, it, it's, a, it's a, a, a whole long process and a, a lot, with a lot of transition, eh? that we're saying that this boy child now is, uh, has been left out in uh, the empowerment that is going on on the side of the girl child? It, of course, it is, a, it is, um, is I, I, I can call it a society, it's a society failure. You, you know the transition, you mm -hmm. know, when you look at the transition itself, the transitional aspect is that you're changing mm -hmm. from what we have, uh, I mean, uh, 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 the, the culture, mm -hmm. the African culture itself, whether mm -hmm. it's Meru, Kikuyu, Kalenjin, yeah, Luos, yeah, yeah. and everything. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Now we transited now to a culture mm -hmm. that was brought in by, by someone else. Yeah. So we adopted now to a white man's uh -huh. or a, a western kind of culture point of, mm -hmm. uh, culture scenario. So that brings now a conflict. Because uh -huh. uh, you lose identity. Yeah. The identity in the sense that a man was seen as masculine, mm -hmm. as a man who, pro who provides yeah. and, um, and, and everything. Now this transition affected mm -hmm. the way the boy child is supposed to be. Because one, uh, there's an identity crisis. Mm -hmm. The modern world me wants the boy child to do, to do say chores. Yeah. You know, you cook, you clean. Uh, uh, yeah. well, something <laughs> that, that 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 I mean, like our culture does not allow. I mean, uh, it does not allow that. So it's like uh, it reaches a point now. We, 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 are, we are creating a less masculine kind of <laughs> kind of word to no. an empowered to an empowered to an uh, empowered woman. Now keep yes. there is a. Uh, from the education sector, especially uh, from uh, back to when people are going to schools, uh, you know, from class eight to, to, to form four, from everything that happens, especially in our education sector. Mm. Is there a possibility that uh, there is nothing that is, or there is very little that is being done for the boy child? Uh, of course, it's very little in the sense that when you look at the statistics now, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, uh, 80s, uh, 70s, uh, the boy to girl in education was almost uh, 3 to 1. Uh -huh. Now, uh, there are uh, more girls in, in secondary school than, than the boys. Yes, exactly. There are more girls transisting, uh -huh. to, transisting, to, transisting to tertiary education uh -huh. and, and the stuff. Yeah. Oh, of course, anyway, yeah. we're, being, we're getting more girls. We're, 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 we're get, I mean, more girls are being born than... Uh, mm -hmm. than boys anyway. Mm -hmm. So probably that, that, that explains yeah. now the, <laughs> <I'm trying to laughs> the difference. But I, I'm saying in yeah. the 80s we concentrated more on this girl. Uh -huh. yeah. So that brought in now um, the issue of um, that brought in the issue of um, we, have, we have more empowered girls. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no empowered boy. Uh -huh. uh, so in short I mean an empowered girl cannot really really get married to just any other person. Uh -huh. uh, from from uh, especially yeah. in, 
when we start from uh, the, the the university intakes and whatever, and the kind of grain, the cut off point, you realize that they are going to favor the the, the girl child. The girl child. Yes. Yet you did the same exam. Yes. You did the same exam, uh, but during when people are going to campus, eh, the cut off points are totally different. Yes. So now my question is: Is there is 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 the equality factor? A, a real thing or it's just uh, you, know, you, you know now the, yeah. the women affirmative actions and everything yeah, mm -hmm. is what because they are trying now to fill a gap mm -hmm. that was male dominated anyway oh, okay. before but um, they are, I think they are overdoing it mm -hmm. in the context that uh, <laughs> they, they are overdoing it now to the detriment of uh, the of, of the boy child yeah because now you, you have opportunities for mm -hmm. example in, mm -hmm. in terms of job opportunities but you, you find now the government have affirmative actions they, they'll mm -hmm. tell you no 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 for every mm -hmm. this position is only reserved for 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 for, for women mm -hmm. or they're saying mm -hmm. um employ three women mm -hmm. one man mm -hmm. you go to an interview mm -hmm. and uh, the boy they are like saying 10 10, 10 people mm -hmm. uh, it, it reminds me of an interview that i did sometimes back and we were like 13 there were like two or three ladies mm -hmm. And they took uh, the lady was number eleven. Yeah. Uh, now, now the boy child, you, you, you got. I mean, I, don't know who you are. Never, I mean that kind of you know that kind of scenario. But yeah. but what I'm thinking is what, what needs to be done is we we we, we, we can't be equal anyway. Mm -hmm. We cannot be equal. Mm -hmm. And I'm not saying that because I'm. Be so I, I, I'm a what a man can do, a woman can do. You have to uh, No, no. In terms of uh, anyway, uh -huh. probably it should be that thing is relative anyway. Mm -hmm. It's not an absolute kind of scenario it's it's relative i mm -hmm. mean because there are things that uh, a woman cannot do mm -hmm. uh, based on the the the, the, the biological mm -hmm. biological yeah. and again in terms of um, uh, the, the culture mm -hmm. you know you know I still come to the the, the cultural aspect the culture, is that because yeah. that one dictates mm -hmm. the kind of um, how now that boy child is going to be because mm -hmm. again we need to take to take uh, to take up uh, our space on the culture mm. factor is um, the religious factor uh, involved in uh, or a respect of what is being done in our culture. You, you know the issue is that uh, um, it depends again on which side of the fence you are in. Mm. <laughs> no, no, in this context. Yeah. When you look at uh, just before, let's say before the white man comes, mm -hmm. are you saying that uh, there was no re religion? Mm -hmm. There was no it was religion. There. It was there, yeah. and it was working very well. Because, mm, yeah. because I mean, the African culture is 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 basically mm -hmm. our religion by, yes, by itself. Yes. So anyway, the modernity now brought in a different aspect of mm. uh, the way we are, we are, we, are, we are looking at religion. Uh -huh. But when it comes now to probably the Christian perspective, is that uh, this issue of choice mm -hmm. is what probably affects in a way that you you're given the, the option to choose uh -huh. uh, a choice. On some, and then you now pick some cultural aspects mm -hmm. that fits you or that go well in well with the Bible, mm -hmm. and then disregard things that are not that are not. We, uh, that we are, are in important. a season mm. that is um, okay. Rather in the, in the political world, yes. uh, that is um, the conversation is all about the girl child. Hey, alikuwa mesaulika sana, sasa mekumbukwa. You know, apa tunavakuwa na mwanaume, apa tunavakuwa na mwanamuke. You know, uh, is there? How do you feel about the conversation? Is it exaggerated? Or is uh, it you know, you know, no, no. The, the issue is that, to, from my point of view, there should not be that kind of conversation. <laughs> there should not even be this affirmative action for for women, women stuff. Huh? Let's compete. I mean, we we both got we, we both went to school. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we did the same course. Mm. We did, we have the same opportunities. Yeah. Uh, the, we have the same opportunities. I mean, I mean, it's supposed to be that we are we are supposed to get the same opportunities. Yes, no, no. Because one be. is we went. I mean, uh, in you know in engineering class, mm. we had uh, yes. we had ladies, mm. and we're doing we're actually doing the same thing mm. in, in the field. So why should the girl should be given priority, mm. and to the detriment <laughs> of of my capabilities? Yes, I have I have, I have kids, I have girls, mm. and I want them now to compete. Without any form of preference, mm -hmm. yeah, that's that, that's one way we can be able now to deal with this kind of uh, with this kind of uh, issues. Say that there will be no need for affirmative action for mm -hmm. what? Mm -hmm. Look at the, the, the American democracy. There is no affirmative action. You, uh -huh. There are no seats reserved for women. Uh -huh. uh, there are no seats reserved for 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 girl child. No, uh -huh. you compete based on your ideals yeah. and 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 uh, what you can what you can bring on the table. I tell you, mm -hmm. you are getting it all from keep uh, keep says. <laughs> That number of affirmative action, who are chanting now, mutu apambane, 
Eh, and we believe that uh, these ladies can do it. Now, on that um, exaggerated conversation, okay, we just say this uh, exaggerated conversation, eh? because let people be, be, you know, be judged on what they can be able to offer, what they can be able to bring on, on the ideals and values. Yes. Eh? Yes. Um, do you feel that it is, uh, it is necessary to save the boy child? As it is now, based on the damage that, uh, that had been done, <laughs> In uh, in trying now to to empower the girl child, uh -huh. uh, and uh, <laughs> my thinking is, we need to 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 go back. Uh -huh. We need to go back to the roots. I mean, when where things were working. I'm not saying in the sense that uh, where things where, where the, the male masculinity was uh, was prevalent. No, because mm -hmm. I mean I mean uh, times have changed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're in 21st century. Uh, those things are gone. Mm -hmm. But of course, we have got an opportunity now to learn mm -hmm. what works and what doesn't work. Mm -hmm. Because by the end of the day, if we don't sort out this issue, mm -hmm. the other day the president was saying that um, there are more single single mothers yeah. than even people in, in family. Yeah. And, I, and, and my point has always been, mm -hmm. if you want to kill the nation, mm -hmm. you kill the family. Mm -hmm. And if you want to kill the family, you, you kill the boy child. It's wow. not even about the mother, mm -hmm. about, 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 about the, 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 the woman or the, or, the, or the girl in the relationship. By, by, by finishing up now the boy child, mm -hmm. is you're, you're, you're killing the nation. Mm -hmm. By all these affirmative, I know affirmative action, some people will say that um, it's a good thing, you're trying to bring up, uh, yeah. no, no, but I'm saying, I, I don't want to, to be harsh <laughs> per se, or to look like um, uh, <laughs> I'm a male, my surgeon ah, no, yeah. is, but the fact <laughs> is, uh, there's supposed to be some order, uh -huh. Yeah, there's supposed to be some order, mm -hmm. and uh, I normally equate it to like, um, even, I, I mean, this is a Christian station, mm -hmm. and uh, you, you or a Christian subscribes mm -hmm. to um god jesus christ yes, yes. and and the church mm. it is in that order there is order mm. yes. so even in in terms of now um for for this kind of scenario mm. i'm not saying that the boy child is I mean, of course by, by biologically culturally and everything the boy even child should be is the head yes mm. is the head mm. and it comes now to marriage and it's supposed to be that way mm. in in everything mm. in everything i'm not saying even in, in job no 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 mm. Of course, in job opportunities, if, for example, now it's, it's about purpose and, and competence, mm -hmm. it's the best. I mean, yeah. if, if the girl child is the best, mm -hmm. I mean, she should be it. taken. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But now when it comes to these other things, because where the problem is, mm -hmm. you know, where, where the, the rain started beating us is when uh, is, it, it's, it, is, is the family, mm -hmm. from the family point of view. Yeah. And what I've told you is that um, that is where it starts. The, 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 the boy child is, um, okay, from 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 your argument and uh, the way you are putting out is that uh, there are so many areas probably that the girl's child is uh, receiving a lot of empowerment and they are becoming they are becoming better than uh, by far even in our profession itself look uh, uh, in a scenario uh, we have uh, we have a women chapter for for, uh, for engineers uh -huh. and they do they visit probably universities to specifically now they uh -huh. Specifically now to, 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 to mentor. Today, um, if a girl is raped, today, mm. everybody will stand for her. Of her course. boy is raped. Every day. <laughs> I mean, uh, the boy child is being raped every and there day. there are organizations that yes. are going to back up, that yes. are going to support the girl child. Yes. Are there organizations that are going to support the boy child? Let's get we there was one, together. but now there was <laughs> one, uh, Mendeleo and Oumbe kind of scenario. <laughs> Uh, there was one, but now, of course, it, 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 I mean, it, it couldn't uh, pick a traction anyway. Because uh -huh. uh, one is, we expected, uh, we expected to be strong. Mm. We expected so, to uh, be. Is the boy child, let me use a better mm. term, is the boy child abused? Uh, all the time. All the time. All the time, yes. But, uh, it's just that we don't come out and tell everybody, <laughs> just like now, the, our, our girls. Uh -huh. I mean, any small issue, they'll tell every every person. Mm -hmm. Look, look at the incidents in the last few few months. Yes. How many, how many uh, boys have committed suicide? Uh -huh. For example, so there's so many, uh -huh. and probably they they are what relationship related, mm -hmm. but there could be another underlying issue. Mm -hmm. Poverty yeah. is also another cause, for example. Because exactly. now, I mean, if for example you're coming from a very humble background, mm -hmm. it becomes difficult. Um, for the boy child, because you can't be calling your dad or your mom every day for, every for, for, time, for, for, yeah. for something. And you can't even open up to friends that we are on a door. Keep, what yes. are the challenges eh, mm. that uh, a boy child mm. is going is or faces today as compared to the girl child? 
Uh, challenges are a bit uh, one. I mean, there are, are many. There are many. Yeah. Uh, but the, the biggest now is opportunities. Opportunities. Yeah. Opportunities. Opportunities yeah. now in terms of um, a, a career progression, for example, mm -hmm. a career path, a very very clear path. Mm -hmm. Uh, mentorship, uh, there's another challenge is mentorship because, mm -hmm. I mean, the way I've said is most mentorships are tailored mm -hmm. to empower the girl yeah. child. So, a boy will, will only know that um, probably he has to work extra, extra hard. Mm -hmm. One is he probably does not have now the, 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 the support because you're expected uh, to, 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 to be strong, mm -hmm. you're expected now to be, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so so mm -hmm. those are the kind of uh, a lot of things. I mean, in terms of career progression, opportunities, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, mentorship, mm -hmm. for, for example, and mm -hmm. uh, a challenge in terms of financial um, challenges, especially if you are coming uh, from poverty. Yes, yeah. especially as you're saying mm -hmm. about that, eh, mm -hmm. you know, I'm, I'm uh, remembering that even the, the girls that we went to school with when we are coming out of college, mm -hmm. eh, you realize they are getting loans, you know, from uh, there's Kenya women, eh? there's something Kenya women, Kenya men. It was actually giving them money, a lot of money. Since you can run a work, 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 and uh, the sort of things. Eh? There is already an organization that is ready to fund them. That is the issue. Because of what? Because of these affirmative actions. Uh -huh. Affirmative actions, because of seven, the, the, these, uh, you remember, I don't know whether you, you remember, <laughs> the, the Beijing uh, women, I think uh, it was in the 90s yeah. or 80s. Mm -hmm. So that's one now that brought in this era of uh, affirmative action mm -hmm. and girl-child empowerment. Okay. Yes. But now we, we the, our four fathers, I couldn't assume that uh, we are, we'll, we, we'll okay, we'll be like them. But you know now, uh -huh. the environment at that time is totally different from now. Mm -hmm. Boys don't have mentors. Because now probably, I am a father, I work. Mm -hmm. So probably I'm out there mm -hmm. all the time yeah. trying to, to make a living. Mm -hmm. And then I've, I've, I've left behind uh, my boy. Mm -hmm. uh, no, nobody is mentoring him. Yeah. Or now a situation where now probably the, the, the family, the, the marriage broke mm -hmm. and uh, now your son is being raised by, by, by the mom mm -hmm. and the mom is now the father and the son. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, <laughs> <laughs> so, by the, so those are the kind of issues or challenges that uh, um, we are facing. On, mm -hmm. this, on all these challenges, mm -hmm. eh, um, wh what would you single out as the main um, reasons why the boy child is not able to achieve or to realize their dreams? Um, anyway, one is, I, I've, I've told you, you know, mm. the way things are, eh? mm. it's specifically tailored mm. to, the system is tailored in a way that uh, for you to make it in life, mm. you have to work extra hard yeah. as, as the boy child. Mm. Especially now, if, you, you, if you're not coming from, uh, from rich background. Mm. If, if, if you are from poverty, you have to work three or four times. Because mm. one is the girl child can easily get married to, to money. Mm. <laughs> no, no. You yourself are very out now. Unless that, that's why you find now the boy child now is doing a lot of uh, a lot of immoral things in terms mm. of uh, dating uh, yeah. sugar mummies or, 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 or yeah, those, those kind of scenarios. Because mm. of that. Mm. Uh, if, if we can be able now to, um, to deal with to deal with that, with with, with that the, the root cause, mm. then uh, and then you give now these boy child opportunities. Mm. You 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 provide mentorship. Mm. Let let the fathers be be take their responsibility. Let uh, the society, yeah. you know, the society uh, is supposed to shape, mm. especially now in the absence of the father. Mm. I mean, in in the past um, you could find the uncles comes in, mm. and they able now to mentor. You won't even know that. Probably this boy or this, this this kid does not have a father, uh -huh. and they will grow to be responsible and and, and achieve achieve a lot in life. Yes. Wow! Mm. Now, um, okay, Waja, you your men's conference. You <laughs> 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 my director uh, instructing me that uh, time is running out, mm. and I want you to do your parting shot. And as you do your parting shot, eh? e men conference. He may say India vijana than the boy child. Eh? <laughs> the, the, the way I'm seeing, yeah, you, you, you know now, uh -huh. the, 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 the ladies in our lives, uh -huh. I mean, I know that they are the extreme ones, we call them feminist, mm -hmm. feminist and stuff. Eh? Mm -hmm. uh, they, 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 are, they, they, they don't like that kind of, uh, that kind of thing, that kind of discussion. Because <laughs> now, if you empower a man, because mm -hmm. it's all about self-conscious, mm -hmm. yeah, self-consciousness. 
the moment you know your role and responsibilities as a man then you can be able to take to take to take to take your place mm. your right uh, your rightful place mm. but the moment uh, if, if you know the narrative is being led by a feminist for example mm. so if they continue Uh, leading this narrative of course the boy child will not even be able to, to rise but the men's conference and the people like uh, kibe and uh, these <laughs> americans and stuff like that are helping out uh, of course there, there are some there, there, there are times they are a bit extreme anyway uh-huh. but um, i mean if you are wise enough you can be able now to pick exactly yeah, what these what guys is, are saying what is, what is and uh, and i'm telling you it's all about self consciousness you mm-hmm. need to be conscious about your own responsibilities as mm-hmm. a man as a boy child and then you take you take it you take it That is so a, the boy hmm. child the boy child from keep eh, <laughs> must take the opposition in fact somebody was uh, i think it's something i was reading somewhere and they said there is no woman without a man even the the the, the name woman there is a man inside of course female of course there is a male, the male inside. inside yes alisema hata menopause iko na men hapo na So <laughs> so you can wind up sir. Uh, okay okay. I, I think uh, my, my point is that um, as I've said we need to take up uh, our, our, our position as men as a boy child. We need to take up these things and take and um, and be what we were made to be. Mm. Yes. Be the leader. Mm. Right. <laughs> Because, because if not, I mean, we will not have a nation anyway. We will not have a nation. And uh, as the president rightfully said, mm. if we continue like this, mm-hmm. I mean, there will be no family. And the end of a family is the end of the nation. And mm-hmm. the end of the nation is is, is the end of everything. Mm-hmm. Is anarchy. Wow. Yes, yes. Mm. You hand it all mm-hmm. from. Uh, this was a he for he talk, <laughs> and I tell you, you got it from keep. That is a uh, uh, keep, and that is what he feels. And. Uh, uh the, the 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 as he says that the boy child must take the opposition they must play their role they must be where they are supposed to be and uh, um as he says that don't keep quiet usinyamaze hapo ati unaelea kufinyiliwa tu ati hata usiku ukitandikwa asubuhi unaambia watu ati vile ulianguka kwa kitanda hapana speak up because it's not good that we have um the boy child uh, becoming extinct kwa sababu ya vitu ndogo ndogo wamejaza kamiti huko wamejaa huko kwingine huko and uh, we need uh, we need uh, the, the, the boy child for today and tomorrow because the generation is supposed to take their role and take it uh, in the right way ah uh, we are so glad and uh, that has been dialogue and the well i'm your host Dwega Prince this is Wema TV every saturday at 6 pm hapa ndio tunasemanga ukweli hapa tunawaambia ukweli this has been your favorite show thanks so much and keep watching We love you so much. God bless you.